Good morning. Morning. We daily vlog. So, so if you enjoy this, this video, enjoy this video. Make come back. sure that you subscribe, <laughs> like, and comment. <laughs> that was the reaction of James seeing pigeons. They're flying street rats, James, but they're so cute. We're going a uh, fancy plant. Yes. Yes. I keep calling it plant fancy. We're going there for breakfast, and then we're gonna walk around, maybe check out some shops. While Sarah edits and just kind of get ready for the day. Let's have some fun. Fancy Plants Cafe, not Plants Fancy, like I was calling it. Here we are. We've been here once before. Eight to four. We're gonna get some coffee, we're gonna get some pastries. Right? Yeah. Here's the menu. Delicious. Good fruits, good fruits, good fruits. Beautiful paintings, fun artwork. We've been here all of two minutes and he's already chosen chaos. <laughs> Do you like it or no? Yeah, he ate it. Is that so good? <laughs> I love the hands up. I got the cinnamon roll and I'm very, very jealous. <laughs> that looks so good. This oh. James needs it right now. James is woken up. He's like, he's talking. He's got his crazy hair. I should probably put your hat on. It's a little windy. Um, I think we might go into some shops real quick on the way back and then walk back to the apartment. You down? Yeah. Sure, let's do you it. You down? So we got distracted. I wanted to bring them in and tell them Dante because we're all coffee snobs. I didn't think we were going to get anything, but Megan is buying a macchiato. Uh, Couldn't resist, though. No, it smells really good in here. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe we can still come back. Yeah. Do like more. I want to try their croissants. They look croissants. so good. And their Girl Scout cookies, but large. They're huge. <laughs> <laughs> look at this cute, cute Intelligentia coffee sign out front. So I have to film this quickly before everybody gets back. Um, today we are having a surprise 30th birthday get together for Peter. Um, planned it on purpose for when Megan and Katie were visiting, of course, so they could be here. Um, and it's going to be at the Chris Kindle Market downtown. It's so Peter. It's like I had this grand idea to have like a big party and just like everything felt like super obvious if it was going to be on the south side if it was going to be i don't know it was just kind of like half needing to like work through like covid restrictions and i wanted to be outside but like the weather had a lot to do with it too so i was like what a better way than for a bunch of people he loves um to come to the chris candle market with us so we are headed there once I am done editing and we get ready to go. Um, and then as we arrive, slowly people will, like, they'll be there already. Um, so that is our plan for the day. Super exciting. Obviously, I haven't said anything because it's a surprise. <sighs> and just another fun way to celebrate Peter's birthday. Um, I think, I'm pretty sure he has no idea. Uh, I took Megan and Katie in the four side. We've been here once or twice before, and I found a prison bike. <laughs> These are some of the best Christmas cards, and they're all like Chicago-y. <gasps> oh, I love it. Um, my mind is blown. I've never seen Chancey <laughs> outside of Sugarboo. What? Are they in with Sugarboo? All right, considering Megan and Katie bought like a thousand things there, this is the last stop before we return back to the apartment. The inkling shot. All right, we've made it to Daily Plaza. Yeah, we happy, happy, happy happy faces. It's cold. It's windy. It's not cold, but the wind is cold. Yeah. Yeah. We're in line. We're already like 80% through the line to get into Chris Kendall Market. James has been asleep since we left the apartment, so he might stay asleep. He might wake up. We'll see. What are we gonna get first? Sarah's not feeling sick anymore, and so she's ready to chow. Sort of a chow. Guy. Was off. I'm feeling a pretzel. I think that's a good place to start. A pretzel? I want hot wine, 
sauerkraut, bratwurst, pretzel, yeah, potato pancake. Everything. It's the last Saturday of the, of the downtown because kind of it's quite busy, but we got a cheesecake pretzel. Dragon Canyon Tour. We're going to go see if the festival tent is in the open seating. I got James with me. He's still snoozing. Got to get me a hot fall wine. We have the Wrigleyville one for a couple more weeks still, but this will probably be the last visit here to downtown. But you're so cute and anxious. <laughs> Made it. What's up? Hi. Oh, it's about time. Hi. Hi. <laughs> 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 What is this? Right and I was like, I like had to double take. You're like, why are you here? Like, your birthday already passed. Yeah. It's your birthday party. Woo! I got that bunch of Mariana's for Thank you. Thank you. Look who's here. Hey, friends. Long time no see. Uh -huh. Tummy time with Tyler. Yeah. We only eat when Tyler's here. Tummy time with It's been a long time. <laughs> yeah. We said that for like three years. For those of you who don't know, I no longer live in Orlando. He just follows us wherever we go. Yeah. I miss them so much. I'm going to be James's adoptive brother. Okay. We'll make it work. We have left the Chris Kindle Market and we are at Urban Space, which is across the street. It's like a food hall and that way anyone can get whatever they want to drink or eat or whatever. But James is... Jamesy doesn't want to sit down. <laughs> when there's food involved, James, James is the anti-pants. We're going into Primark. Has the only Primark you guys been in been in the one in the UK? I think so. Yeah? Yeah. Alright, we are with the Petruses and Tyler at Primark. Our family has gone home. It was so much fun. Thank you so much, Sarah, for surprising me with that birthday celebration. I had literally had zero idea. James had a good time. I had a good time. It was nice to see my family members downtown. Not something we always get to do but very, 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 very nice. So thank you so much, Sarah. I love you, I appreciate you. Good celebration, just like exciting and different and but also relaxing at the same time. Like it wasn't too much, we just kind of sat around talking the whole night. So very, very, very good. I think we're heading back to the apartment after Primark. We're gonna say bye to Tyler after Primark. He's taking the Metro out to the Burbs. We'll take a bus or train maybe up back up to Wrigleyville. So it's a good night. I was so surprised I couldn't even eat, so we're out to get food. It's only like nine. Yeah. Not too bad. We did stay there longer than I expected, but did you like the Chris Kindle Market? Yeah. You guys awesome. will have to watch their vlog to see what they 
eight. <laughs> because we kind of like took shifts like going yeah. out and in, so yeah. So we were lucky enough to find a table in a tent that was nice and warm so that people could venture out into the crowd in Chris Kindle Market as they needed to get stuff. And then we had like a home base. It was like the perfect scenario for it. It worked out great, so. We surprised him, Jamesy. We did it. Uh, we got the party animal, which is pork and gouda. I forgot what kind of empanada Sarah got, but we're gonna take that home because she left with James because he was not too thrilled. And what did you get? The black beans. Nice. You know how you know you're in your 30s? When you're like terribly exhausted and you go look at the clock and it's like just past 10. But I love it. I don't like it. I love it. I love, love getting old. It's a, uh, a blessing that many people don't realize that they should be uh, humbled to have, so. I love that it's 10.28 and I'm utterly exhausted. I'm glad I'm 30. I'm glad everybody tonight was like, you're so old. I was like, I know, isn't it great? Anyway, we're just kind of chilling, relaxing for the night as we wind down. We have an earlier start tomorrow. I'm very excited about our events tomorrow morning. And thank you, Earhearts, for helping get us those reservations. I can't. All right. We're all winding down, going to bed. Um... Thank you again, Sarah, so much for a wonderful night. Thank you for all the family and friends who showed up tonight and gave me well wishes. Very, very unexpected, a lot of fun. And tomorrow, we have another fun full day of events planned with the Peters is still here. So thank you so much. Love you all, and uh, it's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.